Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Don't Feed the Monkeys. Don't Feed the Monkeys is a is in beta right now and it is by the same people that brought us Beholder Beholder 2 that sort of thing. <laughs> and as you can see here it's a nice little collection of characters. Devil, Hobo, Chicken, Mr. Horse. And let's have a little look here, shall we? Interesting little choice of music. So this is a game where you get to play as a voyeur, and who hasn't wanted to do that from now and then? I mean, if you're into it, there's lots of websites. But anyway, we will go right past that. So you get to play as a voyeur and you have to observe the monkeys. And by monkeys it means people. And machines. And stuff like that. Little Illuminami monkey. So without further ado, remember that this is a beta. Let's get on with the game. And our little avatar, we're going to pick Rubber Ducky because anytime I get to pick Rubber Ducky, I always play Rubber Ducky. Because Rubber Ducky, you're the one. You make that time so much fun. And generate a new game. <laughs> Primate Observation Club. Do you know remember following the strict vetting process? Your membership. It must be really strict if I go down. Your membership application has been approved. Welcome to our club for wildlife enthusiasts. Please read the contract carefully, accept the following terms and conditions. Might help if I click the right button. Okay, the club is an organization dedicated to the study of primates in their natural habitat. As a member, you have the privilege of observing the specimens in their cages loaded in your Monkey Vision 2.1 application. To maintain your club privileges, you will be obliged to move up one level every five days, which will require you to purchase a certain number of cages. And by cages, they mean hidden voyeur video cameras. Because we're creepy like that. You'll start at level one, friend of the monkeys. You will need to purchase five additional cages to move up to the next level. Every five days the organization will meet to evaluate your progress. If you have not met your target, you will be expelled immediately. Do not discuss the club or its activities with anyone. Never uninstall the application and above all, do not forget that interaction with the primates is strictly forbidden. Remember, do not feed the monkeys. And like anything that says you need to accept to keep going, let's click accept. So, there's the installation of Monkey Vision, and we have our mail, we inform you of your payment for order 3457, registration fee, the reception is has been successful, thank you for your payments. And this is a copy of the terms and conditions, who reads that anyway. So we have a calendar. That will tell us anything that we have coming. Our finances. As we make purchases. We have the paper. So far I haven't seen anything on the paper that's really worth it. This is our book for our observations. The telephone doesn't do much. We have a fridge. We can get delivery. Or we can go to the store, which is open 24 hours. Right now we have a hot dog and an apple. We have a bed so we can sleep. We have our coffee pot because coffee is very, very important in life. And we have our job board in which we can do jobs to make extra money. Because money is important. So let's have a look-see. So when it's flashing up here, 
it shows us that there is something important going on. And it is basically a quick puzzle game. When words come up in yellow here, you need to click them. And we have Chat Me Go. Master Maiden. Hey, are you there? Hello. It wasn't easy, but you got in. You're part of the elite, my friend. <laughs> you can thank me later. <laughs> now you know what you have to do. Play by the rules and save up a ton of money. I told you being a club member wasn't cheap. Now don't make me look bad. After all I've done for you. It already looks bad. You look like you're freaking from a BDSM club. Okay, the money thing might be a problem. I know, you told me about all your shit jobs, but cages are expensive. And if you don't buy cages, you're out. You knew that before you joined, my friend. So start working some overtime. And there are other ways of making money. What are you talking about? Come on, use your imagination. There's plenty of dough out there. <coughs> it all depends on how much you're willing to get your hands dirty. Blackmail. I'll be willing to cut off my right hand to stay in the club. Okay. I don't think I'd go that far. Right, your monkey vision must have just been installed. I suppose you're dying to reserve your cages. But be careful. Because this shit's addictive. What do you mean? This is worse than tobacco. Spent so much time on it the first week. That I didn't eat or sleep. Almost ended up in the hospital. So eat properly. And rest from time to time. Okay, we'll talk in phone. Okay. Bye bye. Um, there's nothing going on there. So, for any, so we can buy a new cage for fifty dollar. And this is basically the end of the game. So, now this little freak bag's gone. I don't think there's anything else to click on this one. I didn't find much on this one last time I looked. I don't think there's really. I think this is one of those still missing stuff. This one. Didn't find anything to click. This one I didn't find anything to click. So, go back to there. So, what you do is you click on the question marks and select the term you think best corresponds to the words in the circle. If you change your mind, just use the delete icon. Once created, you can use the new word in the search engine to move forward in your investigation. So, things like you go there, and sneak photos. And then you update the browser, and research the terms in your notebook, collecting one word to enter it in the search engine, then click search for me button. You can also represent a pair of terms by clicking two words to enter them in the search engine, then click the search for me button. So, search for me. So, black market, fortune. Nothing else on there. Nope. So, go black market search. Nothing. There's no yellow, but no yellow ones on there. A lot of these will just bring up the exact same thing. Uh, edit compartment. If 
goes beep like that, then there's usually something going on in one of the rooms. Putting up some more sexy photos. So we got Cotton Princess. Or that little mouse. As you can see, it basically makes up a, um, geez, what do you even call that? basically let you make a diagram showing how everything's related sort of thing. Princess Busta. There we go. So if you have a contact in notebook, you can use telephone or chat by clicking the corresponding. I can't remember the chat. Also, let's use and video games. likes to be watched while being watched. So, is it... Yeah, let me see... Princess... It's just that same one. Of some monies. So I got a hundred and seventy four dollar. Still nothing going on there. Okay, 
Here's a day two, your car and club rankers. One for the monkeys. Days of Jack's Revelation for you. Four out of nine cameras needed to move to the next level. The landlady will be in tomorrow. So this comes up every day. I said there's nothing really ever in there, so I think it's just fun things. But what we will do today, we'll buy ourselves another camera. Club member will invite you to collaborate our wildlife observation studies. To do so, you will need to provide us with certain information about some of the cages loading your monkey vision. Once we have verified the information is correct, you will be compensated for your work. Okay. And yogurt's on sale. Page will be available at 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. So, seeing that there ain't much going on, of enhancing our database and all the heavy volunteer compilation is the observer of cage one. Let's reply this same here. What is the name of the primate living in cage one? So this one we need to work out this person's name. Faithful friends, manufacturing sailor, blob dolls, and companion mannequins. <laughs> That's funny. Anywho. Ted, where are apostles of local Williams Witness Church. Do you have a minute to hear the word of Billy Bob the Holy Butcher? Okay. Wonderful, I'll tell you a bit about him. Billy Bob Walt was a humble butcher living in the country's most rural region. He was slicing bacon one day and found a secret message formed in the fat. He merely left Chattapoon where he the birth game and found his own church. I'll tell you more about him another day. We want to ask you to pray a favor for this beautiful plan with you. Would you look after it for us? 
will come pick away again in a few days. If you're a person of Wooten's witness can trust, you'll see that you'll be an even more beautiful and vibrant. And don't worry about water, the plant feeds on kindness pervading the air in the room. We'll return soon. Okay, so now I have a plan. I'm gonna order us some Chinese. Drink us some coffee. So, this is the clues down here that we need. Uh, that sounds about right. Six out of ten drivers unable to. <laughs> I'd rather get stuck in an elevator with a North Korean dictator. They should have someone to like lean your arm on. I think this is where we're gonna leave this one. If you like what you see, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. If you wanna see more, make sure you say, let me see more. If you don't wanna see any more, say you suck. I mean, I probably do. I'm not very good at this. But I have fun, that's all that matters. So without further ado, thank you for visiting I Like Pie Gaming, and I hope you have a good one, ladies and gentlemen.